early adopters of private wireless networks are seeing a return of investment already within six months. That's the true benefits of 5G. Hi, I'm Steve Douglas, Head of Market Strategy with Sparn Communications. Recently, we've been engaged in uh, private network work and had a survey with over 200 enterprises to really do understand what types of business benefits they're looking for with private wireless networks. One of the key outcomes with over a thousand enterprises that have now started to commercially launch and use private networks is that business outcomes are the driving factor for their business case. A business outcome of increasing productivity, reducing downtime, or having their greater efficiencies within their environments. And these business outcomes are now tied to SLAs. SLAs which are becoming more and more critical to be met. Making sure that the network, the devices and the applications deliver on the performance, the reliability and the security to make sure that these new outcomes actually can be achieved and those return of investments can happen within a very short time frame. Now what's really interesting is that when we look and work with our enterprise customers on private 5G is that security has become one of the most dominant requirements because up until this point in time, our survey identified that the best effort or ad hoc networks that they had put in place today to try to unlock some of these outcomes were insecure. They weren't providing the true levels of security and reliability that would be required to actually implement these next generation use cases. The second key takeaway was really around the utilization of an advanced technology like 5G, especially for uplink traffic. In many cases, video monitoring is a key use case to unlock value, whether it's monitoring assets on a supply line or in a production chain to make sure that there's no faults or issues being brought into the networks. Or alternatively, we're starting to see that those their same high definition videos can be used to look for anomaly detections uh, within systems, avoiding potential downtime. The challenge has been up until now, 4G has not had the bandwidth to provide the relevant uplink for high definition video to do real time image recognition. Neither has the Wi-Fi networks, but 5G has that potential. Already we have seen end users who have adopted 5G in private networks deliver outcomes such as 15% reductions uh, in terms of experts having to come to site to fix faults and 3 to 5% productivity gains over a year period. These are millions of dollars of outcomes that actually can be achieved. And that's why today we're starting to see broader and wider adoption of 5G wireless technology in our private enterprise environments. It's no longer just about trials today, it's about true adoption. Mm -hmm.